The mathematical term well-posed problem stems from a definition given by Jacques Hadamard. He believed that mathematical models of physical phenomena should have the properties that a solution exists. The solution is unique. The solution's behavior changes continuously with the initial conditions. Examples of archetypal well-posed problems include the Dirichlet problem for Laplace's equation, and the heat equation with specified initial conditions. These might be regarded as natural problems in that there are physical processes modeled by these problems, problems that are not well-posed in the sense of had de termed ill-posed. Inverse problems are often ill-posed. For example, the inverse heat equation, deducing a previous distribution of temperature from final data, is not well posed in that the solution is highly sensitive to changes in the final data. Continuum models must often be discretized in order to obtain a numerical solution, while solutions may be continuous with respect to the initial conditions. They may suffer from numerical instability when solved with finite precision, or with errors in the data. Even if a problem is well posed, it may still be ill-conditioned, meaning that a small error in the initial data can result in much larger errors in the answers. An ill-conditioned problem is indicated by a large condition number. If the problem is well posed, then it stands a good chance of solution on a computer using a stable algorithm. If it is not well posed, it needs to be reformulated for numerical treatment. Typically this involves including additional assumptions, such as smoothness of solution. This process is known as regularization. T. Konov regularization is one of the most commonly used for regularization of linear ill-posed problems.